On this video, I am going to show you how to share a Google Calendar event automatically through WhatsApp. It looks like this. I have an important meeting in my calendar and we don't want the other person to miss it. So we're gonna be configuring an automatic WhatsApp message that looks like this. Meeting reminder with Ricardo. Here's a link to the Google Meet and the date and the time. And you can, we will configure this however you want. And that message will get sent automatically 24 hours before, you can also configure that so the person doesn't miss the meeting. So the step number one is to go to confirmify.com. I'm gonna leave a link in the description and basically make sure you're in the English version and just click start for free. You're going to need to create an account with Google. Once you're inside the app, step number two is to connect the Google Calendar where you will be saving the events. So I'm gonna go here to add a calendar and I'm gonna select Google Calendar. And finally, I'm gonna be using this calendar, my meetings calendar. Remember that in Google Calendar, you can have multiple calendars here on the right. So you can choose whatever you want, wherever you want to store your appointments. The next step is to configure the messages that we will be sending. So basically it's gonna, you can configure a bunch of stuff like your time zone, the time system that you wanna use, etc. It's gonna ask you the message type. If, if you want to RSVP, which asks the person if they wanna come or not, I'm just gonna do a reminder for now. And then you can configure how many hours before do you wanna send it? I'm gonna leave it at 24. And here is where we configure the WhatsApp template, okay? So I have a meeting reminder with Ricardo. I put, uh, let's switch this to a meeting reminder with Ricardo. Please join this Google Meet. And we're gonna be adding the Google Meet link here. So I'll, I'll type this variable, Google Meet link. And basically this reads from Google Calendar and paste the link right there. Uh, we wanna show the date and the time, and this looks good to me. So I'm gonna leave it like this. You can even send you a test message if you wanna test it. And that's it, we're gonna be saving it. And then we're ready for step three, which is basically creating Google Calendar events like you regularly do. So I'm just going to create an event tomorrow at 9 a.m. I am going to select the calendar that I connected to Confirmify, which is called my meetings calendar. And I'll say, important meeting, and I need to leave the WhatsApp of the person that's going to be receiving the message, okay? So I'll type it right there and you can leave it in the title or in the description. It doesn't really matter, confirm if I will detect it. And I'm going to add the Google Meet uh, link. Then we save this, and the next thing that's gonna happen is confirm if I detected that there's an event, we are within the 24 hours that we configured, so it will send the WhatsApp message. Take a look at this. That's why it added the jello dot. And if I come to my WhatsApp, right here you'll see meeting reminder with Ricardo, and please join this Google Meet, and there's the Google Meet link and the time of the date of the meeting. So there you have it, super easy. We did it within, I don't know, less than four minutes, and this will definitely help your clients, customers, or whatever, stop missing your meetings because everybody is paying attention to the WhatsApp. So this will deliver the notification where we have the highest chance of getting a hold of them. So I hope it works for you. And if you have any question, just leave it in the comments and I'll be happy to answer it. Thank you.